Hello, yes. Reyes? That's correct, Marco Reyes. Yes, I'm on my way down there. I'm just stuck in traffic. It was supposed to be 9.30. Yes, I was hoping we could reschedule maybe this afternoon or tomorrow. Yes, I, I understand it's important to be on time. Are you sure, really, I could come anytime? I could always just... Is it... Okay, well... Hello? Yes, that's what an awful person. Totally. How did it go today? Uh huh. How did it go today? Okay. Talk to me. What do you want me to say? Tell me how it went. I'm not gonna get it. Oh. Why not? Oh, there were a lot of people there. So? So they looked like four year university types, not two-year community college types who still haven't finished their last three classes. Hey. Todd, I gotta go. Your mom's here. You know you're worth more than that, right? Mm. How long did you work at that auto parts place? Like three and a half years? And you did everything for that guy. You did the books, you paid the guys, and you did his taxes. So what? So what? That's real world experience. It shows character because you stepped up and took charge, and people love that shit. Yeah, yeah and so do I. Ooh. Oh, let's go out to eat. Oh, that might be a problem. Mm, not if we use my new credit card. No, no way. No way. What? Why not? I think using credit to eat in restaurants is a really bad idea. Mm, but the baby really wants Thai food, and I have a coupon. The baby is going to have to settle for something else. <sighs> It's just temporary. We're only gonna do it until you get a job and then we'll pay the whole thing off. Oh, what's the interest rate? Cheaper than starvation? Come on, let's go. Uh, no dessert. Baby really wants dessert. Mm, then I get four beers. Two beers and you have to put on pants. Okay, deal.
Hello? Yes, this is Marco Reyes. Who's this? Yes, I did email my resume yesterday. Thank you for calling me back so quickly. I am very interested in the position. Excuse me? I I'm, I'm sorry, I don't understand. Why would you call the police? Are you sure you have the right, Marco? Hello? Hello? Your ass, man. All right, just shut your mouth and let me blow shit up, all right? Good today, Todd. Oh, suck my dick, old man. Can you hear me now? What? I called your name like five times. Sorry, I didn't hear you. I guess I lost track of time. Sorry. Hey, I need to talk to you about something. And you have to promise not to get mad, okay? Okay. Did you actually go to that job interview yesterday? Yes. Yes. When you drive the car, you always back it in, and it wasn't backed in. You want to change your story? I didn't go. Why not? The alarm didn't go off the fucking thing, and I woke up late. I called, job. I tried to reschedule, but the fucking bitch hey, on the phone. Why did you lie to me? You don't have to do that. We're a team, remember? No secrets. Right. So, uh, what about your secret cell phone? My what? Marco! That's not mine. Oh, sure it's not. Marco, you pay the phone bill. Wouldn't you notice if there was an extra charge? It's probably one of those prepaid things. Yeah, from when? The 90s? Look at this thing. It's a relic. Besides, if I had a secret cell phone, wouldn't I just leave it at school? I know what I saw. Honey, the people who lived here before us probably just left it here. <sighs> it was on today. You got a text. Show me. It's probably a battery. Yeah. That thing's been out of battery for like 20 years. Then why was it still ringing? You heard ringing? I mean, it's more like a... It was probably the neighbors. You know how sometimes it sounds like something's coming from inside the apartment, but really it's coming from next door? Like the time they're having party sex? Maybe. Are you sick? Oh, you're kind of warm. You should lay down. <laughs> I'm gonna go shower. Okay, a cool shower. I'm gonna go shower. Cool shower, okay? Cool shower. Yeah. You know, it's probably stress. Yeah. How much coffee are you drinking? So every much. Day? Yeah, it's probably the coffee.
phone to myself all day and he's still not gonna hear you. Because I know. Fine. Are you happy now? <laughs> hey, um, I need to talk to you about something. We're gonna be a little light this month. 1500 I know, I know it's a lot of money. Yeah, it's, it's two months of rent, it's all of our bills, all the baby stuff. No, I'm glad you called. Yeah. He is, he's just... The interview process takes a long time and these people don't make snap decisions, you know? Yeah. I love you too. Where'd you go? I had to clear my head. You can't just do that. I didn't know where you were. I don't know what's wrong with me. I don't have to be here, you know. I could just go home. This is home. It doesn't feel like it. This is Marco Reyes in apartment 413. I got another one of your notes today, and I don't appreciate it. I know I'm a few days late on the rent, but you have no right to enter my apartment without my permission, and this is the third day in a row. Now, I expect these notes to stop immediately. Otherwise, I'm gonna be forced to take my complaint to the relevant authorities.
D'Artagnan. Sorry, my bad. I have great news. Yeah? What would you say if I told you that I got you a job at my school? I can't be a teacher I didn't graduate? Okay, uh, not with the teachers. With the engineers? A janitor? It's $13 an hour. That's less than I was making before. Yeah, but it's more than you're making now, which is nothing. Oh, so that's what you want, huh? Watch me push a broom mm -hmm. all day. I do. Do it, mm -hmm. do it. I Get that money. find that sexy. I would like that. Yeah. <laughs> Look, my dad worked shit jobs his entire life so that I wouldn't have to. And so now you have to work shit jobs for your son. It's just temporary. Nah. Nah? Look, I swear, I will find a job before the end of the week. You have a job. All you have to do is go in and fill out the application. I already did all the work. I will think about it. You're the one that says that men should work. I mean, do you like this? Do you like me supporting us? I already said that I would find a job by the end of the week. You have a job today. Why don't you clean the apartment by the end of the week? I... Did you do this? No. I cleaned all day for you. I... <laughs> Why'd you do this? No. Hey, we're not done talking. No, I don't get you. I really don't. I put myself out there for you with my employer, and now I have to go back to him and say that you don't want it? I see what you're it puts doing. Me in a weird position. What am I doing? It's the only explanation. You want to fucking break up. My God, because I want my college-educated boyfriend to actually get a job or I want to come no, home to a clean house and you don't want to break up. to say it so you act like a bitch but until it's... Oh. I'll never help you again. Oh, why should I care, Dana? Because if I go... Fine, you want to leave? Oh, good. Go ahead. Run home to mommy and daddy and all their money. I'm sure we're all going to be a lot better off now. No, we won't. You won't. I won't. The baby definitely won't. Hey, when you get there, uh, be sure to tell your mom that I said thanks. No, for the rent. She loves you. You're the father of her grandchild. So sure. That she loves you or that you're the father? And you need to be really careful about how you answer that. I have my doubts.
damn it. Okay. Hey, um, what do you call a cow with no legs? What? Ground beef. <laughs> You're good with these. You should try stand up. Mm, mm. <laughs> I'm working on my five minutes. This is really good, by the way. I should probably have you cook for me all the time. Does the baby like it? Mm, yeah, he loves it. It's his new craving. It's our new craving, actually. Oh, and the crib? I love it. It's perfect. How did you finance this little celebration? Hmm. I pawned my gun. You look nice. <laughs> you know, it's funny. I was gonna skip the tie, but it makes me feel normal for a change. you and I missed you and we're a team right let's get married you know how I feel about that he deserves it yeah Pat it's not gonna fix what's wrong what's wrong assistant. Oh, yeah? Yeah. And I'm going to help you make calls and follow up on those calls and mock interviews and we're just going to fix this thing together. Okay. Yeah. And as soon as people figure out how smart you are and how hard working you are and how gorgeous you are, they're not going to want to hire anybody else but you. Right? Right. Starting tonight. Starting tomorrow? Starting tonight. Starting tomorrow. Starting tomorrow. Starting tomorrow. Hmm. Where are you going? I have to pee. Tough. I will sympathy pee for you. 
It's gross. I thought we should just share it uh -uh. with you. No? Well, good. I don't have to share my pizza anymore. <laughs> I don't look like a scientist. Sexy scientist. You want coffee? Just a half. The name of the game is Follow Up. We are going to make a list of all the places you sent resumes to right here. Okay? Thank you. Gosh. Sex makes me horny. Okay. Well, we're supposed to be working. Mm, I thought you were my secretary. Is this how you treat a secretary? I don't know. Are you going to put on a miniskirt and high heels? Uh, hello, human resources. I'd like to report a predator. That's me, the predator. All right. You can harass me once you get the job. How about that? Okay. So we're gonna make a list here. It's gonna have the name, the company, email, and who you sent your resume to. For what? Because you're gonna call them and you're going to say, did you get my resume? And are you scheduling any sort of interviews? Shake the tree, see what comes out. That's really good. Okay, where's your resume? It's on the desktop, it's called Marco's resume. What are you doing? Um, looking at it. There's no reason to, it's fine. Why not? I mean, I'm just gonna take a look. You're just gonna tell me it's no good and try to change it, and then all of a sudden, it's no longer my resume, it becomes your resume. Oh, Marco, this is a third grade, I'm not gonna make fun of you. All right, fine, do whatever you want. All right. It's hot today. I don't know how you stand that thing. I need it. You know, they're not exactly giving away free electricity, so it gives me a headache. Uh, cool, refreshing air gives you a headache? It's bad for you, just open up a window. Opening a window just makes it hotter. Not if you open one in the bedroom and then it creates a cross breeze. Oh. Sexy secretary, but no sexy sex. I'm gonna go have sex with myself. You know, babe, I think you should be a sexy scientist. You're way too overqualified to be a sexy secretary. No, we caught it. Okay, will you just come in here and work, please? It's very funny. Look, seriously, sometimes when the windows are open, the wind catches the door. No, 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 not that. This. I will kill everybody at your scumbag company. What is that? I, I don't know. I just clicked on it. That is not mine. I, I don't get it. Well, it has your name on it, and it says resume, so... Is it possible that you've been sending this one out? No. No. Please believe me, okay? Someone is messing with me. You think someone broke in here, changed your resume, and tricked you into sending this out? <sighs> yes. That is exactly it, and I know who. Who? The landlord. I am serious, he's been coming in here. When? Every day. Well, he's not allowed to come in here without our permission. Oh, I know. He sneaks in when I'm not looking, like when I'm in the shower. Well, how do you know that? He leaves notes. That say what? You know, just landlord type shit, stuff about the rent. Okay, do you have any of these? <laughs> I threw them all away. I called him though, and I threatened to turn him in. I bet that's why he did this. So you think that the landlord broke in here and changed your resume? Look, babe, who else could it be? You didn't do it. I certainly did not do it. Hey, but what reason would he have to do something like that? I still had my gun. Hey, Marco, 
You need to put that knife down. I'm glad I sharpened these. No, Marco, you're not going anywhere with that knife. You need to sit down right now. Look, okay, I am not gonna hurt him. I'm just gonna scare him a little bit, you know what I mean? You need to sit down. What did the notes say? I told you. What did they say exactly? Stuff like, see the landlord, or are you sick? See, that doesn't make sense. Why would the landlord come and put those inside? Why wouldn't he just call and leave a message or knock? Who else could it be? There's only one person it could be. You. It's not me. It is not me. Think about the notes. Don't they sound like warnings? Yes. Warnings to pay the rent. We're going to kick your ass out. Or warnings to yourself about stuff you're worried about. Okay. I can prove it wasn't me. Okay? Look at the handwriting. I thought you threw them away. I took pictures. Check it out. What am I looking at? That is the last note and me rewriting it. You rewrote it and then took a photo? Just to make sure. To make sure what? I wanted to see. I'm not crazy, don't give me that sad look. Okay, I, I didn't call you crazy. But the notes, the resume, the phone. I mean, I just stood there while you threatened to kill somebody. You haven't been acting like yourself, am I wrong? No. You need to call somebody. Fine, call. I'm not gonna do it for you. Why not? Because I'm not gonna force you to do this. You have to do it because you want to. Because you want to get better. And say... What? I don't say. As soon as possible, I guess. Hey. How'd it go? What'd you guys talk about? Are you feeling better? I haven't even taken them yet. She wants me to start slow. Having, babe.
Hello. Yes, this is Marco. Oh, excellent. Thank you for calling me back so quickly. I am really interested in the position. It sounds like it's right up my alley. Okay. Yes, I'm, I'm available. Uh-huh. Yeah, I could definitely make that. That, that sounds good. That, uh, that sounds good. Okay, okay, um, what time did you say again? Okay, yeah, it looks like it was a fan belt. Fan belt? You're gonna be looking at about 279, unless they find something else, you know? I think he has the wrong number. It says here, uh, Marco Reyes. Is that you? Yeah. I wanna tell you what's happening. Were you outside just now? I saw somebody. How would I know what you saw? He told me to call. We got a real problem here, you know? Why did you get rid of your gun? I needed money. Look, Marco, the clock is running. You gotta do something. You've been sitting around acting like you don't even care. You got your baby. That bitch has been lying to you this whole time. She's been out screwing every fucking guy in town while you sit there like a jamoke. nothing unless you get mad. Mad as me. Hey, listen, I haven't really been, uh, you know, feeling that great lately, you know? This ain't a hospital. No, but I mean, like, maybe I don't 100% trust everything that I, uh, you know, see or, or hear. Oh, yeah? That sounds like what happened to my brother-in-law. This one time, these punks graffitied his house, right? He works in a metal shop, so he got some of this uh, industrial solvent, like he's gonna take the paint off the bricks and some shit. Only the container had a little hole in it. It was seeping out into the cab of his truck. He didn't even know it. He ended up poisoning him for months. He ended up thinking squirrels could read his thoughts or some shit. Really fucked his shit up, you know? All right, I don't have anything like that, man. Yeah, well, you never know what they put in stuff these days.
any yoga. Fuck is that? Going to daddy dinner? Hey, what's up? Hey. Marco? I... Look at this face. Well, he said it was a 5.2. Are you okay? Marco? Okay. Are you okay? Are you hurt? Marco? It's okay. <laughs> Do not go in there. Boy, this place is a real shithole, huh? You smell that? You seriously don't smell that? Smell what? Your funeral. <laughs> Come on. Don't you want to take a picture? Get the fuck off of me! Hey! I fucking had it with your crazy shit, man. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? Relax. I'm a friend. Whoa, whoa. I'm just here to help you with your Dana problem. Oh, yeah? Well, you know there is no fucking Dana problem. I know exactly what you are, and I'm gonna take this fucking oh, shit no more. Fuck! Shit, look what you did! Look what you fucking did! Where the fuck are you going, huh? Get the fuck out of here! <clears throat> shit, maybe not.
Yeah. Oh, 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 no, they didn't tell me anything. Yeah, I gotta scan every apartment unit today. I got no, 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 no,
Hey, what you doing? I'm fixing it. You ain't fixing shit. Shut the fuck up. You ain't fixing shit. What do you think so here? I'm trying to catch smoke with a butterfly net. You think the answer's in that goddamn air conditioner? Wake the fuck up! This is crazy shit. It's some frackers. Did you just say something to me? It's up in toxic waste from my goddamn city. Where are you calling me? Uh, it's just like that, Steve. You think it matters to me? I don't uh, care. Just get rid of that thing for all I can. Do whatever you want to do. Just throw it out the window. It's not gonna make a difference to me anyway. Honey. Huh? Honey. It's not a big deal. I don't. It is just a big leave deal. Leave it alone. Stop it. Honey. You ain't doing shit. Shut the fuck up. Mark. You fuck up. Out. You're the fuck up. Yeah, shake it. Shake it. Marco. That's it. <laughs> Marco, listen to Shut me. Shut up. Leave him alone. Please listen to me. Yeah, I recently had a visit from one of your inspectors. I think I found something he missed. This is Dana's voicemail. Leave a message and I'll call you back. Dana, call me back. I can't take it right now. I can seal it. There's gonna be a big old package outside by the trash. Nothing to worry about. Someone who's bonded with the state will grab it in a few weeks, I guess, but it's gone. Babe, just, I am so sorry. We are gonna be okay. It's over. Everything's good. You can come home. You gotta be kidding me. Did I mix up my Tuesdays? Next Tuesday. It's next Tuesday. God, I gotta get that planner. It's like I'm kind of old-fashioned, so like I still want to write the planner out, but I understand sure. I need to use Google Cal, right? You can use both. Have Should you thought about getting a, uh, what do you call it, a bullet journal? What's a, what's a bullet journal? <laughs> it's when you write down uh, what you're going to do, like, day by day and hour by hour. Do you have one of these? That's too specific. Hour by hour? Yeah, it's really, I love it. How do you factor in naps? I write them down. You plan your naps? <laughs> no, I've never thought that. You're so beautiful when you blush. something to show you. First paycheck. Finally. Can you believe it? Let's go out to eat. We'll order beers. I'll drink yours. What's this? I have to go. What are you talking about? I, just, I, I can't be with you here anymore. 
What are you talking about? Come on. We both know this has been coming for a long time. No, I don't know anything like that, okay? So let's just sit and we can talk about this? I've always wondered what's best for you. No, look, I know it was rough, okay? I know, I, I was an ass. I couldn't help it, it wasn't even me, all right? It was that, you know, that stuff. I wouldn't have made it if it wasn't for you, okay? So let's just... Where's the baby? What baby? I took you to the doctor. I saw his pictures. I don't understand. Mayor, I need you to be okay with this. No, but look, okay, you don't have to do this, okay? You could stay, we could be together, all right? I'm not like I was before. I'm better now. I got better. That's why I have to go. Did you ever have a conversation with a mechanic? You know about that? Did he feel real? I don't think so. How do I feel? <laughs> but I love you. You're moving on, you're starting a new life, and you don't need me anymore. I do need you, though. I need you to. I swear to God, I need you. You're gonna be okay. Yeah, I want to talk to someone about enrollment. I just need to take three classes so I can graduate.
Thank you.